welcome to our today's lesson so in this very video we shall be considering this very topic so we're going to be looking at this very topic which is limited the velocità 80 km so uh, in English this uh, discipline means you know uh, the limit uh, the limit speed the limit speed of uh, of uh, of 80 km so now let us uh, quickly you know uh, take a look at the definition so the definition says il segnale refrigerato è un segnale di divieto e prescrizione so you can see it here what is it saying here is that <coughs> this sign that is referred here so is known as a forbidden sign and, and also a prescription sign so as we all know when we are talking about you know a, a forbidden sign in other words is simply saying that uh, this very sign that is here that uh, in terms of you know of you driving so this simply is simply saying that this is the maximum speed that you are expected to drive so uh, in terms of driving so you are not you know permitted to to drive a speed that uh, that supersede this very this very one that is here so it's simply talking about so the maximum speed that you are expected to drive so uh, the the speed limit so and it says sikiyama limited the velocity at a kilometer so and it is making us to know that this thing is called you know the speed limit of 80 kilometer so it's the speed limit so it's a forbidden sign that you are not permitted to drive you no know, uh, uh, the limit speed that is above this very one that is here so in a situation like this you can drive 70 you can drive 60 you can drive 50 you can drive 40 you can drive even 30 depends on the road but what they are saying here that you are not permitted to drive above this very one that is here which means in other words you can't drive 81 you can't drive 82 you can't drive 90 you can't drive 100 so take note of that and it says in presence of the signal limit, limited the velocity of 100 km it says in the presence of this very sign that is here the limit speed of 80 km it says a vietato superare la velocità di 80 km so he said that it's forbidden for you to drive an above 80 km in the presence of a road that has this very sign so you can't drive above you know the the speed limit of uh, of 80 km uh, una validità validità immediatamente dopo il segnale steso so he said this very sign this very sign so is valid immediately immediately where this sign is located and after where this line is so take note of that he says è consentito circolare è una velocità inferiore a quale indicata indicata nella segnale so it says that you should continue this consentito continue permitted so it says you are permitted this circular simply means to drive so you are permitted to drive a velocity inferior simply means a a, a a a limit or a speed that is below the this very word inferior a speed that is below this very one that is here if you don't require indicator indicator and the signal so a speed that is you know below this very one that is here like 70 60 50 so you can drive it on the road that have this 
So let us quickly look at, uh, you know, uh, some questions. And before we, you know, move straight to the questions, it says a limited development uh, or tantal kilometers. It says the the speed limit of uh, velocity of 80 kilometer. It says questo signale per traversare anche sulla autostrada. It says in autostrada, which is in the highway. You know, in autostrada, the highest, the one that have 130, the permit the speed limit of 130, it says it can also be found. It's more like a warning sign. So, take note of that. We have some quiz to quickly consider. So, in respect to this very lesson. So, number one question says, we are going to be very brief because of time. So, number one question says, it says, il signale refigurato è un signale di divieto. So it says this sign that is here is a verbiti sign. Vero or false? True or false? True, because it's a forbidden sign. It's a forbidden sign which does not permit the velocity that, that, that is above 80. So the answer to this one is vero. Take note of that. Number two, it says, it presenza the scenario refigurato e vieta superare la velocità di 80 km. So, vero or false? Now, it says in this presence of, they have this very sign that is here, it's forbidden for you to drive the velocity that is above 80. So, the, uh, the question now says, <laughs> true or false? So, the answer to the question, the answer to the question is true, because you cannot drive uh, a speed, a speed uh, limit that is above 80. Take note of that, number three. He says, il signale refigurato può trovarsi anche sull'autostrada. So, he said this very sign that is here, you can also find it in, uh, in highway, in autostrada. So, true or false? True or false? Vero or false? So, it's vero, because you can also find it in the highway. Due to our explanation, we, we, may, we, you know, we stated something like that. Take note of that. So number four, number four, it says a limited velocity indicator sul la signale refigurato a validità immediatamente dopo il signale steso. So it says this very sign that is here. <coughs> so the validity, so is immediately where the sign is located and and after the sign. So true or false? True, because we we said it during our explanation that. Yeah, the, the validity of this very sign so starts immediately from where this sign is located and after the sign. So take note of that. Number five, it says a signal refrigerator prescribed the marcha a velocità inferiore or qual or uguale a 80 km. So you say this very sign that is here it prescribed for you for you to drive marcha simply mean for you to drive. So a velocity that is below or the same 80 km. So it's vero. It's vero. So in a situation like this, you can drive below below 80. And you can also drive exactly 80. But the only thing that you are not permitted to, you know, to to, to exercise in this very road. Is that you are not permitted to drive above 80. 81 is not permitted. 82 is not permitted. From 80 below, that is the only thing that is permitted. So it's vero. Take note of that. So number six. It says a signal refrigerator e un signal di prescrizione. It says this very sign that is here. So it's known as a prescription sign. Do we have one explanation? We you know we say something like that. So it's a prescription sign and it's vero. So number seven, it says the signal refrigerator it pone di mettere una distanza di sicurezza di almeno di 80 metri. So this very sign that is here, it say that you know it talks about you to maintain the distance of your driving, and this very one that is here, it talks about you know the limit of your speed. It's not talking about the distance of your driving. So for that reason, the answer to this one is false. So take note of that. It says the signal refrigerator non si riferisce a motocicli. 
So he said that this very sign that is here, so is not to be respected by motorcycles. Those driving motorcycles are not to observe this very sign. And it's fast. So. Whether you are driving motorcycles, whether you are driving any vehicles of any kind. Of, so what they are saying is that you need to respect this very sign. How do you respect it? You respect it in the sense that you are not permitted to drive and above 80. So your speed limit must be what below 80. So take note of that. So th this is the reason why this one is fast. So. That is number, number nine. It says, Signale refugurato indica la velocità consigliata. So it says, this very sign that is here, it indicates a velocity consigliata. For something to be consigliata simply means the something is not compulsory. Whenever you come across this very word, you come across this very word consigliata, so it simply, simply means something that is not compulsory, something that is not obligatory. So it simply means you, if you like, you may respect it or not. So this very sign is a sign that, you know, that is compulsory. Is a sign that you know everything that is driving on that road need to respect. So, so for that one, number nine is fast. So, so number ten, it says the signal refugurato permite di effettuare il sorpasso a velocità superiore a 80 km. It says this very sign that is here, it permit an overtaking with the velocity that is above 80. It's fast. So. So number 11, it says signal refugurato vieta circolazione de veicoli de massa totale superiore 80 quantity. So he's saying that this very sign that is here, it forbids the drive of vehicles, you know, that is above weight of 80, you know, uh, that is above weight of 80. He's not talking about, you know, the, uh, the weight of the vehicle. He's not talking about the weight, the lightness of the vehicle. We are simply talking about the velocity. So for that reason, this one is fast. So take note of that. Number 12. It says, Il signale refugurato obbliga a respettare un limite minimo di velocità. So there is one thing I will want you to understand here. Minimo e massimo. So for this aspect, we are talking about massimo. Massimo in the sense that you can't drive above 80. When we are talking about minimum, minimum simply means below. Maximum simply means, you know, above. So in this very case, we are looking at the maximum. Maximum, the velocity. In other words, the highest speed you are permitted to drive here. So this very one is fast so because of the minimum that they, that they stated here. So number 30. It says, the signal refugurato vieta il transito ai veicoli che per construzione non possono rigogliare la velocità indicata. So he says, this very sign that is here forbid the transit of vehicles that is used for construction. He says for that reason, they cannot drive the velocity that is indicated in this very place. Now let me tell you, this very sign does not forbid any vehicles. So, but the only thing is forbid is that you can't drive the speed that is above 80. So for that reason, the answer to this one is first is faster. So number 14. It says the signal refugurato vieta ai veicoli di superiore super, superare la velocità indicato. So it says this very sign that is here is forbid vehicles that drive the velocity that is above 80. And it's zero. So it forbid any vehicles. That, that drives above uh, above 80. So take note of that. Number 50 says, Il signale refugurato obbliga a respettare un limite massimo di velocità. So he said this very sign that is here is obligatory for you to respect the maximum of velocity that is indicated in this very place. And it's vero. So number 60 says, Il signale refugurato indica la velocità massimo alle quale i veicoli possono procedere. So he said that in here, the velocity, so the maximum velocity <laughs> that is indicated of the vehicles also that is driving on this road can drive and is zero.
So number 17. He says this in LR Figurato prescrive obrigo di viaggiare a velocità non superiore 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 a 80 km. So he said this very sign that is here. So it's um, it's very compulsory, it's obligatory that you don't you don't you, you does not drive a velocity that is above 80. So is there. So number 18, it says innumero rifigurato nel segnale indicata indica la velocità massimo consentita. So it says this very sign, this number that is here, so that is here that is indicated in this very sign, it simply you know talks about the maximum speed that you are permitted to drive. So and is vero. So number 19, it says the signal refugurato consente di circolare la velocità inferiore la quale indicata. You say this very sign that is here, it permits the driving of the velocity that is below this sign that is indicated here and is vero. You can drive 70, 60, 50, so but the only thing you can drive above 80. So take note of that. So number 20, it says the signal refugurato indica un limite di velocità valido solo per auto veicoli. So this very one is fast. So it says it signal this very sign that is referred here. So it says it indicate the you know the the uh, speed limit so and is only valid this was solo per auto veicoli for some only only vehicle for, for some only, only only vehicles no it's valid for all vehicles so this very one is faster so what make it faster is that word that is here solo take note of that word so number 20 whenever you see the word solo solo simply means only only soltanto only so all those two things take note of them so they are very much important Number 21 says the signal is refugurato obliga a respettare the limit minimum di velocità indicato. So this very one is faster because of the minimum. So he's not talking about the minimum, he's talking about the maximum. The maximum speed that you are to be respected. That you are to that that, that that's to be respected. So that is that. Ah, sorry. That one is uh, is faster. So number 22. It says in all era figurato, it pone ai veicoli che non sono grandi o superiore. Uh, it says the signal era figurato, it pone ai veicoli che non sono in grado di super superare gli 80 km di marciare sulla cosia di destra. So this very one is faster. Why is this? He says that this very sign that is here. So he says is he uh, it, it, it does not uh, talk about you know uh, a velocity of uh, of uh, of eighty. You know in the driving of uh, the of the road of the uh, on the right hand side. So it's fast, so it's not talking about something like that. So number 23, it said, il limite di velocità indicato da segnale refugurato entra in vigore a 150 metri dopo il segnale steso. So when we are talking about 150 metri, we are talking about segnale di, di pericolo. So a warning sign, but this one is not a warning sign, so it's a divieto sign, a forbidden sign, so for that reason, that one is fast. So. Because of time. So number 24, it says the signal refugurato vieta il transito ai autoveicoli con massa complessiva superiore a valore indicato. So it talks about, you know, this very sign that is here. So it forbids the transit of vehicles, you know, that uh, has the weight that is above this very sign that is here. It's not talking about the weight of the vehicle, it's, it's only talking about the speed limit. So this one is faster. Lastly, number 25, it says signal refugurato indica un limite de velocità valido del alle ore 88 alle ore 20. So they said this very sign that is here. So it's only valid 
from 8 o'clock in the morning to 8 o'clock in the evening is far so. So in any area where the sign is indicated, both night and day, so the sign is to be respected. So and it's compulsory for you to respect the sign. So for that reason, this one is far so. So take note of those things. Do remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can see it. We have zero error. So see you in our next lesson. We have zero error. We have 25 over 25. So please do remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. And